Hey guys, it's Shell. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Welcome back to another try on haul. I am shopping for summer, but also a cruise. Y'all, this summer is actually going to be like, we have stuff to do this summer. I actually have places to go this summer. So I'm actually gonna need clothes to go to like these different functions. So if you're not subscribed, just go ahead and subscribe. Also make sure you like this video. But all of this stuff is from Shein. So anyways, let's go ahead and get into this massive, massive summer slash shopping for my cruise and vacation try on haul from Shein. Okay, first things first, I know I have a different setup. I'm supposed to have like a little rack, clothing rack thing that Amazon is just being a butt about and they haven't delivered it and I don't know if it's gonna come and I'm waiting on it and I don't wanna order it because what if the other one does come? <laughs> so this is a work in progress. Just bear with me and also if you have any ideas, let me know. But this right here is a size 4X. I think it's a Squirt. No, these are just shorts. So we're gonna go ahead and try them on 4X. Ugh, these are cute, but like what usually happens with these bigger, wider legged shorts, which by the way, I freaking love, like literally obsessed with, cause how cute are these? I don't love how it looks here in the crotch though. Just It's just not flattering, but that's so unfortunate because these are so freaking cute. And these would be so good for a date night because I'm really looking, because if you don't know, I'm dating. We're exclusive. Is he my man? I don't know. I don't know if, if officially call him my man. But I actually have places to go. And I'm actually looking for clothes to go to said places. So this would be something that, how cute is this outfit? For a dinner? For anywhere. Like we were supposed to, this past Saturday, we were trying to go to Puttery and didn't know you needed reservations. We know now. But I was gonna wear a dress and I was like, oh, we're gonna be like, I'm gonna be like bending over, bending, getting up, I don't really wanna wear a dress. So this would have been freaking perfect. <sighs> but that's not, look, look how cute this would have been. All right, moving on, we've got a ton. One thing I'm on the lookout too, as y'all know, maybe you don't, I have been doing 75 soft. Let's just talk while we undress. I've got a, I've got a bodysuit up underneath, who cares? Um, I'm doing 75 soft and in doing 75 soft, I'm working out literally every single freaking day. And girl, <laughs> I don't know if you've been outside lately, but it's hot out there. So I'm looking for some cute workout clothes, which I have a haul from Fabletics coming. Oh, I cannot wait to get the things I got from Fabletics. But I'm looking for some cute workout clothes to kind of break up the monotony of like all the workout clothes that I currently have. Now I freaking love these with the exception of these <laughs> are just going to keep riding up. Like I love this biker short thing with the running short over it. I love this style, but it's just not fitting me properly. This is what it looks like in the back. I don't know. What do y'all think of this setup, by the way? I, I feel a lot more, more comfortable in this setup. Like, I don't love that my bed is like literally right here, cause it kinda, but I feel like, you know, I don't know. I just feel like this is the best setup. Hello? I feel like this is the best setup, but let me know what you think. Um, anyways, these would work, but they, come up too much. But see how like they have the cute detail on the side? So cute. I will say when it comes to Shein, I'm usually like a 5X. I'm like squeezing into their 4Xs now that I've lost a little bit of weight, but it's still like really hit or miss. So I do want to put that out there. These are kind of like those, I call them butterfly shorts because they just remind me of a butterfly. Like they're very flowy and, and girly and cute. And I love them. You have the short up underneath that's very stretchy and then you just have this really flowy open side. I don't love, see that whole issue with the crotch again. 
I don't love the way it looks, but I love the way that these feel. But look how cute they are. And then look how they're like super flowy and like in the bag and stuff. These are so cute, but unfortunately they're just not gonna work for me when i tell y'all i went crazy with these little running shorts i went crazy because i have a freaking ton of them these are also a size 4x look how cute these are before i try them on look how cute they are with the with the pink lining these have pockets these are that kind of uh, wind breaker material stretchy size 4x love that I don't know label it's cute it's cute let's try it on these are cute they are tight in the waist I don't have as much of a problem in the crotch area and with these ones so you'll see oh these are cute oh these are really cute these are so reminiscent of the freaking 90s I really haven't seen these since the 90s. Have y'all? I'm sure that they, they've had running shorts since then, but... Oh, I have got... Look at these. I have got to keep these. These are perfect for a pool cover-up, too. Bathing suit cover-up. Oh, no. You're not covering up the pool, Jill. You're covering up your bathing suit. I keep going in a pool cover-up. Bathing suit cover-up. I'm going to Carowinds tomorrow. These would be really good at Carowinds. Like, if they don't, like... I'm gonna see. Um, I feel like they're gonna rot up my legs. That's the only thing. These are so freaking cute. I love these and I love how they look on me. Okay, next are these ones. These are also a 4X black and white, super cute. These are actually like 70s style, but I do remember having these type of, these, these kind of shorts when I was thin and early 2000s like before kids hold on this is yes so this is what we've got you've got the short the biker short up underneath and then you have the runner shorts i freaking love this style of shorts yeah see look at that i just did that and they're all so these are a no until my thighs get a little smaller. Okay, these ones are like those pink ones, only they are a bright highlighter yellow. They are also a 4X. These ones don't have pockets though. That's the unfortunate thing. But they are very cute and they're that same kind of material. Oh, these are, oh, these are cute. Okay, that's my shapewear up underneath. So you don't have, hold on. That's what they look like on the side. Do y'all see? So, oh, that looks so good. Okay, hold on, let's do that trick again. <laughs> Cause that, that's very important, you know? It's not like you sit there and you're doing this, but you are getting up, getting down, and I really am looking for shorts that don't do that. So unfortunately, these aren't going to work either. But if I could just stand here and look cute, they would totally work. But that's not real life. So, ugh. Why? Okay, last but not least, we have a tennis skirt, which again, they're having such a moment lately. And I'm here for it. This is a size 4X. It's cute. However, them shorts up underneath, absolutely not because they're a little, they're a little tight, but this is so cute. Look at it. Look at how cute that is. If those shorts were a little more like the shapewear where it was very stretchy and it wasn't digging in or anything and also don't move, that would have been perfect, but that's unfortunately not the case. That's the only reason why I say that this is a no for me is because of that fact. Because this is so cute. And look how cute this is. How cute is this? How cute would have this been, like, on my little date? Don't love that. You'll see. So, 
Unfortunately, no. But if you can fit in a 4X and below at Shein, seriously, these are some really freaking cute, cute things. And these running shorts are so on trend. The little butterfly-ish shorts, I call them butterfly shorts. But those are very trendy right now. And these tennis skirts, again, they are so on trend. They're having a moment. Okay, so before moving on to shirts, I want to show you this. Because I am trying to be team no tan lines this summer. So I'm looking for a strapless bathing suit. And Shein has some really cute ones, actually. This one is a size 4X. I'm not even going to try on because this is going back. I'm not going to try on the bottoms because I tried on this shirt. And keep in mind, currently I have on a strapless bra. So I have a little bit more padding, a little bit more oomph. Obviously, I do not swim like that. So this looks a little bit better with the bra on. With it off, it's just not flattering. And I want it to be so bad because, again, I'm trying to be team no tan lines this summer. Doesn't look like that's going to happen. And then there's this one, which is, again, if I had a bigger chest, I feel like that makes all the freaking difference. Like, this looks so much better with a strapless bra on. But I already know because I tried this on without. It just doesn't look good. So if you have... A bigger chest this is probably gonna look really good on you but again I don't know y'all I might just risk being looking tacky or something because I really don't want those tan lines tomorrow I don't know but this is the second strapless bathing suit you just have classic black bottoms this was a 4x and this also fits as well but unfortunately it doesn't look great without the bra, so it's a no-go. This would be cute as a shirt, though, like to go out in. What do y'all think? Hold up, hold up. Did I just fix it? Can I go to Carowinds like this tomorrow? I think I just fixed it. Sorry, I said that a little loud. I need to try this on without a bra because again could I really go swimming with a bra on y'all what do you think what would that be like because this looks so good last but not least for the swimsuits we've got this one now this one comes with straps I don't currently have them on because again I'm looking for something that is strapless and I actually did wear this to the pool I didn't love it. Again, it doesn't look great with my boobs kind of like sagging. It looks great with this strapless bra on. So as you can see with this one, it has this little tie right here that you can tie it up so you show a little bit of your stomach. You don't have to if you don't want to. And that's the beauty of this. Again, you can also have the straps or you can do away with them. It doesn't matter. It does have some padding in it. like. You can see the padding right there, but it's just not, it's just not very supportive for me. But here's the back, very cute. Now we are moving on to tops. This is a size three, two X? Jill, what were you thinking? I don't know why this is a two X y'all, cause I would normally not order a two X. Hold on, what, what do we got going on here? I hate halters with hair because no matter what, nine times out of 10, you're getting hair stuck in that halter. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hold please. <sighs> okay, hair is definitely caught. I don't love this whole double strap. Like why, what? <laughs> hair is caught, hair is like caught, caught. Oh, okay, okay. What, what are we doing? Hair was like caught, caught, okay? We got it out. Oh my gosh, this would be so freaking cute if it weren't so low cut. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. 
I wonder if my little, I got a little stitch machine. I will link it down below. It's like a little handheld gun thing. Because no, how cute is this? I don't know, this is a very, very sexy top. I freaking love this and this color is so vibrant and beautiful. Let me come close. It is beautiful. Look at the back. It's a little, okay, don't look at the tie because it's just, it's a hot mess. <laughs> but, if you can get it right, you know, this is what we got going on here. So it is a little shorter in the back, and then your back is open, and then here it is in the front, which it has the little handkerchief style. Alright, next top, this one is a, probably a 3, no, I got everything, all the, all the tops in a 2X because the dresses are now 3Xs, that's why I went with the 2X. Okay, I still feel like I probably need to do a 3X in the tops because this one, again, I don't love, it's a little too low cut for me. And it's also a little too tight in the waist for me as well. But it's it's super cute. Can you tie this? Probably. Tiny little bow. It's ribbed. Love the color. A little too low cut. I think I already said that. And I don't love it on me. But I definitely think I need to stay with three X's on the tops for now, for sure. This is part of the Shein Vacay line. And this is completely see-through, like it, not see-through, it has holes all the way throughout. And I feel like this is also a two, no, this is a 3X. But yeah, this is part of their vacay line. And I can already tell you, I tried this on the other day and I didn't love it. I was trying things on for a date. And, um, why didn't I like this? Because this is really freaking cute. I was wearing it with different jeans, so maybe that's why, but this is cute. I think it was the jeans that I had on, because I wasn't wearing these jeans. I feel like if I was wearing these jeans, I would have been like, oh yeah, for sure. But this is super cute. I mean, it, you can kind of see through it. You have to keep in mind, I also have lights on right now, so like lights, like, you know, glaring. I don't mind that. I really don't. I don't think that that looks that bad. But if you do, you could totally just wear a black bra up underneath. And this is cute. It's like a little peplum. I think that this is a really great size for me. What did I say? It was a 3X. 3X fits really great. This is what it looks like in the back. And it is very cute. Oh, I love this. I love this a lot. Okay, last of the shirts before we move on to dresses. This one I also tried on that night and I was like, absolutely not, it's not happening. I was just, y'all, I tried on like my entire closet pretty much and then just settled on something that's so generic that I've already worn with him and I'm like, didn't wanna do that but I felt the most comfortable and I just need to get out of my comfort zone because I'm like, look at all of, y'all even tell me. When, I, when I'm like showing y'all what I'm wearing, I still don't love this. I still don't love it. Um, it. It looks okay on me. This is a size 3X, I believe. I don't know why I don't love it, I just don't. Um, but as you can see, it's one shoulder, asymmetrical. It kind of, yeah, it's even asymmetrical on the side here. When I look at myself in the mirror, like right now, I feel like, no, I still, I don't, I don't love it. I don't love it. But when I look at it in the camera, I'm like, girl, you crazy, it looks so good. Anyways, this is this. If you want a little asymmetrical moment, here you go. Let's move on to dresses. Here is our first dress. I don't love it, I'm gonna be honest. I don't love how it looks on me. I feel like it's very shapeless. I feel like it makes my boobs just look really, really small. I also don't love the fact that you have to tie the straps. I just not the biggest fan of that I don't love this I don't love it on me I do love the color though it's a little I feel like I really look pregnant in this like oh my gosh you have the accordion stretch in the back this one is 
so pretty. I didn't think I was going to love this sage on me. I like it on me, the sage green in the fall. I didn't know that I, would get it, that I was going to love it in the summer, but it's just not functional for me because of this. It's very cute, cute, but as you can see, it's very low cut. There is no padding in here. And then the straps are a tad bit loose. I can see them falling throughout the day. It's very, very pretty though and very flirty. And the whole idea behind this haul was me wanting to get shorter skirts and shorter dresses, I mean. So that's, all of these dresses are shorter. But this is what it looks like in the back. And again, you have this bow, which is really cute, but you just cannot wear a bra with this. And unfortunately, I'm just one of those girls that just cannot go braless because I need support. I love how girly and flirty this is. Girl, you go braless, get this dress. It is absolutely stunning. And I know for sure this comes in multiple different colors as well. Bahamas, here we come. This is exactly what I was looking for. Yes, 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 yes. I'm wearing a nude bra, I don't care. You can see it a little bit because it's got the little hole right here. You've got adjustable straps, it's easy, it's breezy, it's short, it's lightweight, it's tropical. This is perfect for my cruise. And just for the summertime in general. So this baby is probably most likely going to be coming with me because this is exactly what I was looking for for the cruise. Because I have long maxi dresses, which I love, but I was thinking for like walking around the ship and stuff, I just want something I can like throw on and not have to worry about it being so long and like dragging the floor. And this is cute. So in the Bahamas, I'm actually going to go see dolphins. I'm going to do a dolphin encounter. I love dolphins. I'm so excited. So for both of the Bahamas spots that we're going to be going to, we're going to be at the beach. So I don't really need a, like a dress for like going around, like touring the Bahamas because we go on straight to the beach. But for, you know, dinners and stuff, this would be really cute. The little, little, little deck. Maybe hitting up the club by myself. <laughs> this is really cute. So I like this a lot. And I could also do a little bralette if I was kind of self-conscious of this. But as you can see, it has the hole and then it has the little kind of twist right there. It does have, yes, it has adjustable straps and it is, is it is in the size 3X and it fits me to perfection. Size 3X, this is so cute! This is exactly the kind of stuff that I was looking for. This is not necessarily for the cruise, but just, uh, let me go ahead and take this off. Not necessarily for the cruise, but just going on dates and like going with my exclusive man that I guess isn't my boyfriend yet, I don't know. But this is really, really, really cute. I love this pattern. I normally don't love a lot of this floral that's smaller. I usually like big, bold floral patterns, but I think that this is just, it's really cute. And for whatever reason, I don't love it on camera, but in real life, I freaking love it. I, I think it like, gives me great shape. It doesn't like cut me off. It's not too, you know, baggy. Like you can still kind of see my shape a little bit. It's cute. It's cutesy. It's like girly and feminine. I love this. This is what it looks like in the back. This is a cute one too. This is really cute too for a little sporty moment. If you have some place you're going that's not necessarily, not necessarily super dressy, and you want to wear sneakers, put on some really cute white sneakers or there's some Converse or like some chunky white sneakers because those are very in right. This looks good. They're very in right now. But, oh my gosh, I love this. 
Oh, I love, love, love this. It's perfect on the side. It doesn't show my bra. It isn't too low cut. It has a little collar. It's very sporty-esque. This, again, if you're like going on a date where it's just like maybe you're, gonna do it, uh, maybe you're going to be doing a lot of walking, a farmer's market, this would be really cute to go to the farmer's market in. Obviously, if you're going to play tennis, because I feel like this is like very tennis inspired, like a tennis dress, this is so cute. I wouldn't personally work out in this because it doesn't have the little shorts up underneath, but very, very cute. I love this. This is probably my favorite out of them all. And I was like, I don't think that I'm going to love this one, but I freaking do. I would definitely, now I will say, I would definitely wear shorts up underneath this just because it is a little shorter. I feel like I would do that with all of the dresses, but it's cute. This one I tried on before my date and I was like, if we were not going to play miniature golf, I was so wear this. I think that this is so beautiful, so flattering, so flirty, so girly. I can do just a little stitch with my little stitch gun right here and not have to worry about my bra showing. Or if I wanted to, not really care about it, because really it's, it's not showing the whole time. I can just wear a black bra up underneath and it would be fine. But y'all, I'm going to a Latin night where we're gonna learn to dance. How perfect is this dress for Latin night? Is it not? Am I wrong in this or am I wrong? Am I right? <laughs> what do you guys think? Because when I thought of like, crap, what do I wear to that? My mind immediately went to this dress and I was like, this dress is perfect because it's sexy, it's girly, it's flirty. It has the little, double layer right here so it's like I feel like it'll just be like a really good dancing dress and basically like Latin night that we're going to they're going to teach us how to dance and I finally have a man who wants to dance with me girl <laughs> I'm so excited and I think that this would be perfect um so yeah I love it I love it it has a stretchy waist and it's stretchy all around so stomach and back and this is what it looks like in the back it does not yeah oh how cute it goes up a little higher so it doesn't have adjustable straps it also really doesn't need it and it's so cute this one great color super cute don't love the material it's that kind of material that i don't feel the best in i would definitely want to wear some shapewear with this because it's that really soft kind of everything moves kind of material. Do you see the detail? It's really cute. It's got like a little ladder detail and then it has like the little buttons that are not functioning. They're just for decoration. And then in the front, it kind of goes down, going to a handkerchief? Yes. To a point slash handkerchief style. It does have pleating. So when you're just standing and looking at it like this, I feel like it's very flattering. I don't love the thinness of the material though because no matter what bra I wear, it's gonna show and I don't love that. I just think that it makes things look cheap. And it's very cute, but I still don't love this thinner material. Although I will say it is a perfect lightweight kind of dress for the summertime for sure. This one's cute too, but kind of the same problem and issue with the last dress. It's that like softer, kind of material. It's really cute. I love how it has the double strap right here. You probably could if you have a bra that has a thinner strap, wear a normal bra, like a regular strap bra, not a strapless. And I feel like with that, this would look so much better because again, I don't love, you can see because of the thinner fabric, you can totally see this outline of this bra. But other than that, I think it's really, really, really cute. It's very flowy. It feels really great and lightweight. I'm like, would this be good for Latin night? Oh no. But it's very easy breezy, comfortable, feels good. I think it looks really great on too. Like I love how it looks on me. You could literally wear this anywhere. Like you could wear this running errands if you want to. It's just very lightweight, cute, but you could also dress this up if you wanted to as well. Okay, now this one is a 3X. This one I tried on the other day and I was like, absolutely not. Like I have literally no shape at all. It is so not flattering for me. 
But the reason why I wanted this and slash got this was because it does have the thicker straps and I was like, oh my gosh, it's perfect for not having to wear strapless. Because I'm going to be honest, I don't love wearing strapless, but as you can see and as you can gather from like pretty much all of my hauls, I love thinner straps. I love just things that require you to basically wear a strapless bra with. But this is like, again, a huge, huge no. I think that this is a 3X. I mean, if you like that oversized, more like oversized kind of baby doll look, I don't know. I would definitely have to size down and can size down on this. Definitely one, maybe even two, because it's not tight around my chest like at all. But I mean, if you had a bigger chest, I mean, look at how much room there is here. There's a lot of room there for bigger chests and whatnot, but it's just, it's not me. It's definitely a little very shapeless. I mean, you could totally kind of maybe um, put a belt on or something, but I wouldn't want to go through that trouble, honestly. Whew! Last but not least, if y'all saw my vlog, y'all already saw me wear this. I, oh, this is coming to the Bahamas with me. Uh, this coming, it's coming on the cruise with me. I think this would be a really great walk around the ship during the day kind of dress or even go to dinner and then from dinner going to a show or a comedy club or whatever. I love the color. I love the skinny straps. I love how it looks on me. It does have accordion stretch from the waist up. And it does have like a little bit of a, it has kind of like a wrinkled kind of texture to it. it. Doesn't look wrinkled, but this is perfect, a perfect dress to go on vacation with because if it does get wrinkled, and y'all already know on cruises, they don't allow irons. They don't allow steamers, and I don't think you can even get an iron. I think that you can maybe send your stuff off to get iron to pay extra money, but girl, I ain't trying to do all that. So this is a perfect travel dress because it's already wrinkled, so it doesn't matter, you know, if it does get wrinkled. But yeah, this is 100% coming with me on the cruise. I feel very confident, comfortable in this, and I freaking love this color. And as I, you know, continue to get darker and stuff, it's going to look even that much better on my beautiful tan skin. And yeah, I love this. Whoo, y'all, that was, that was a doozy of a haul. That was, how many things did I try on? I have literally been filming for like three hours. <laughs> and I don't know how long this video is going to be, but whoo, that was a doozy of a haul. But I hope that you guys enjoyed. As always, everything is going to be down below, linked down below in the description box. I always try to make sure that I do it in the order in which I tried it on in. Love you guys. Have an amazing day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.